Good morning, guys. It's a little light out. Um, it's Sunday. Uh, I had to wait till 7 o'clock to hit the gym today. That's all good, though. Whoa, music. Hello. Um, today is going to be day one of, I guess, my improvement, bulk, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to, uh, I'm not going to like bulk, bulk like you think the term bulk means. I'm not going to go in the gym and push a ton of weight and then go home and eat. 4,000 bajillion calories a day, but um, for the last two weeks I've been dealing with some shoulder pain, so I've been taking it extremely light. So uh, today we're gonna up that a little bit because the shoulder's feeling a lot better, and we're just gonna slowly increase the weight, increase the reps, and uh, yeah. So today's gonna be a push A day. It is Sunday. I usually do my push A on a Monday, but I'm gonna do <clears throat> Monday, Tuesday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Weekend off, Monday will be my push A, and then the routine will be back in action. So I'm gonna go do that. Let's pray for uh, no injuries, which I doubt I will. It's always important to stretch. Don't forget to stretch. Um, I have the day off today. I gotta do some yard work with the mother today, and then I'm gonna get a lot of code work done, and we'll see what the uh, day has in store for us. But until then, peace out. Alrighty, we, uh just got done working out. I feel like these last two videos have been the same, but it's all good. I've been working out, coding, it's what I do, it's the way I live. Um, just got done my push workout. I was able to push. Do you hear this? This guy. Love you, buddy. Yeah, just got done my push workout. Um, my shoulder's definitely gotten better. So I'm extremely excited about that. I was able to uh, up the weight a lot. Now I felt a little, little give back, but I was able to up the weight a lot on that. Like I said in the previous clip, um, I'm gonna start, you know, taking the gym a little more serious. I took some time off, so I wanna, you know, add a lot of muscle. Um, since gyms have been closed forever, I couldn't exactly get in there and do that, especially since I was on a cut that fell apart too. But yeah, we had a successful first day. Um, of using heavier weight I'm gonna say it is only 1130 right now I just got done outside uh, doing some work with my mom we're doing uh, some stuff in the backyard we just got a new deck so we're just doing some things around there and the rest of my day is probably going to be some coding I might do a little bit of WordPress um, I've been learning react JS which is a framework for JavaScript and I really want to it's more of a library technically it's like a library slash framework um, makes JavaScript writing a little easier and it's actually extremely fun. So I'll probably be doing a lot of react today Which I'm extremely excited about. I love learning it. I'm having a lot of fun tried to learn it last year But it was so confusing because I didn't know enough JavaScript So I will be learning a lot of uh, react today Hopefully doing a lot of review because I took some time off from learning that to um, dabble in the WordPress for a little bit but my it seems like my path to learning stuff is like I want to learn something here, then it's here, then I want to do this, then I want to do React, then I want to do backend, then I want to do PHP, then Python, then this. It's addicting. It's crazy. Um, yeah. So, I wanted also to go over, um, I put on my Instagram the other day, I have two Instagrams, I got my main Instagram, which I don't really go on anymore, and then I got my, uh, other Instagram, which is dedicated to developing, and it's kind of just, I do a daily post on there. Just to spit out some knowledge to the world and try to get people motivated and inspired to, you know, do things they love to do. So I changed my name. It was, um, the handle was Gormley co underscore codes. And I actually ended up changing that to code fit underscore lifestyle. And the main reason behind that is because ever since I started my fitness journey, I, you know, completely transformed my life. I learned a lot from it. I lost a good amount of weight, I became healthier, and just everything, like my mind was right. Ever since I left college, I just felt a lot better as a human, and it's it's been a life changer for me. Fitness has definitely done so much for me. So I learned a lot through that, and then, you know, after college, I still didn't know what I wanted to do for a career. I graduated um, with a digital design, Bachelor of Arts, but it wasn't exactly, I was doing things I didn't really, you know, love to do, I wasn't going to sleep. Excited about it. I wasn't waking up dying to do it. So then I started to learn programming and that's where my whole world changed programming slash coding 
Um, the digital design aspect definitely helped me with, you know, web design. Right now I'm a front-end web developer, so the design part from school has definitely helped me a ton with that. I think I have a good eye for design. I know it looks good. I know it looks pleasing to the eye and, you know, for the user using that website. So, those two words, coding and fitness. You know, short and fitness, that's where the code fit comes from. And then lifestyle is pretty self-explanatory. It's a lifestyle I want to live. Uh, my entire future, I, I literally know it, is going to be all around code and technology, which is such a good thing to, you know, know because the whole future is going to be full of technology and I'm going to be the one helping create that technology. So that's awesome. And then fitness is another thing. So coding and fitness clash together is pretty much my entire life um, on top of, you know, building an awesome family, loving my family, my friends, all that good stuff. And I see a bright future as long as I can stay the course and do what I want to do. I'm going to do what I, I can't even speak right now. I'm going to do the stuff I love to do every day. Wasn't that hard to say. It does a short little synopsis of why I changed my Instagram to code fit underscore lifestyle. Um, I honestly want to create like a brand out of it possibly. Um, we'll see. This is just my imagination kind of rolling. I have these weird um, times in my life, or recently I should say, where like I'll just be sitting there and I'm like, ooh, here's a company idea, or ooh, here's a cool business idea. So code fit underscore lifestyle is something new I'm creating. I don't know where or what or who or when, where, why, what it is, what it's going to be. Right now, it is only my Instagram title, Instagram name, handle, and it's the way I live my life. So we're going to see what I can do out of that. But yeah, that's the reason for the change, and um, I like it a lot. I think it, you know, I think it flows well. So stay tuned for that. I'm going to be building that. Hopefully, you know, that's something I can figure out and build off of, but that'll be the game plan. So you'll see a lot of that wordage and stuff like that pop up through my videos and my Instagram. And like I said, it's the way I live my life. So all my videos are dedicated to, you know, coding and a fitness lifestyle. It's going to be a lot of fun and I'm really excited. So that explains that. All right, it is the next day since you've seen that last clip. Um, all I did yesterday was pretty much just work. And then, uh, I don't even know what I worked yesterday. I was off yesterday. That's embarrassing. Oh, wow. Um, I just did the yard work. I coded it. And then I kind of went to bed pretty early. I was really tired. But I got some work done at night. So that's what happened since you last saw me. Just got done work. Uh, I worked 7 to 4 today. And we are about to be at the gym, which is right over there. And then I'm going to my girlfriend's house. Happy Labor Day. I'm going to be eating some burgers and some hot dogs. And then tomorrow's another day. Uh, this video is probably going to go up. Today's Monday. I'm hoping for you guys on, we'll see this Wednesday. That is the goal. Um, I don't know what else I'm going to record in this video. Kind of just recording whatever I want right now. So um, let's go hit this workout. I'm going to eat some food. And I'll get with you guys soon. Peace. Just destroyed that pool workout. That was back and buys. Completely smashed it. Had a really good workout. I actually finally bought some pre-workout again. Um, my pre-workout I have is Ghost Legend. It's actually pretty decent. There's only like 100 something milligrams of caffeine. Or like 200. It's not too bad. I used to take something called ESP Extreme. High stim. Had some crazy ingredients in it that made me just go ballistic. But we're not taking that anymore because I don't want to have a heart attack uh, at the age of 30. So that's done. But um, that was a good workout. And like I said, I'm about to go to my girlfriend's house, smash some burgers and hot dogs. And uh, I am extremely excited how life is going right now. Um, just because I'm kind of like back on my grind. I'm really focusing on, you know, my fitness again. I'm really focusing on my coding again. I'm trying to become the best web developer that I can be. Not exactly trying to be the best of the best. Or actually, am I? Yeah. I'm trying to be the best of the best. Uh, I just want to honestly take programming to a whole new level. And as I said earlier in this video, my new Instagram is codefit underscore lifestyle. And um, a big reason behind that, as I said earlier, is that coding and fitness is part of my life. 
and it's pretty much going to be my life for forever and that's kind of how I want to live the rest of my life so you can expect a lot from that and like I said I don't know if it's going to be like a company a brand I have no idea but uh we're going to make something magical out of it because I'm uh I want to do something like that I want to own a business one day uh what kind of business I don't know but I think the best way to make a business is doing something you love every single day and that's what I want to push every single one of you guys watching this video to do as you know when I was in high school college even a little after college I honestly did not fall in love with anything that I love to do I thought I did you know I went to college for engineering second year of college I switched out of that for digital design fell in love with that but then once I graduated college I was like I don't want to do this anymore but then when I started programming I fell in love with it. I didn't even want to go to the gym anymore. That's how bad I love this. I still love it. It's addicting. Very addicting. So, uh, coding and fitness, that's my life. We're going to make it magical. So, thanks for watching this video. I appreciate everyone. We're going to be back on the grind with YouTube. I feel it. I'm enjoying it again. And, um, yeah, I'm like, I'm posting on Twitter every day, posting on Instagram every day. Or my one Instagram, that's codefit underscore lifestyle. Haven't said it enough. So we're really just going to use the last three months, three and a half months, four months of this year and just push ourselves. And uh, we're going to end 2020 like crazy. A lot of big stuff coming, but I just got to work towards it. So, yeah, this video was a bunch of random stuff. So thank you for watching it. Um, like I said, lots of stuff coming, but I'm going to go smash some food. And get started on my next video. So, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you have not already. I want to hit 100 subs before the end of this year. Big goal of mine. Like the video. Comment down below. You guys, it's going to be Wednesdays today when you're watching this video. So, enjoy the rest of your week. Later. I'm hungry. Bye.